That's so weird that it's doing that. Well, well, no matter how many times we try to back out of this quest that we didn't want to do yet, it's for some reason is making us do it. So I guess we'll do it. Hey. We're in the water tower now. Respawn. This game's really glitchy. Well, at least Sophie, we can get an inhibitor. Jack and Joe are in the tower. They're gonna blow it up. Dear God. If they do, we will have no water source. Come on, Aiden. The tower is mined. Try to disarm the charges. Uh, oh, I'll go up this way. <sighs> Active Jerry quarantine. Find disarming explosive. Okay, where the fuck is it? Oh, it's right here. Alright, here we go. Uh. Oh, you mean the explosive? Yeah, I have no idea. No, exactly. What? Can you hear that? Beeping. Oh yeah, you go right in. Oh, whoa! Take it off? Yeah. I just don't know where to go from here. Yeah, I'm... Hmm. Oh, is it this way? No. It's outside. No, I think I may. Yeah, I figured it out. Go back in the room. We. Oh, it's Jack and Joe again, okay. Give me the detonator, Jack. No, we were supposed to take tribute to collect money. Jack, give it back. Got it. Where's that? And the water is safe. Jack, I'm Found another one of the things. <clears throat> inhibitors. Oh, you got the second. Yeah, I found the inhibitors too, but I didn't find the other one. I think you got six inhibitors. I got a lot of them too right now. Oh, it's up I again. I spend any of them, yeah. Yeet. <laughs> That's weird. Oh wait, there's a chest over here. Is there? Where? Yeah. Oh, look at that. I'm gonna look at my points. I have a ton of points. that landing rotating stealth mm -hmm. movement wall run 220 240 now I could wall run jump sweet nice. I'm so speedy now oh my oh my Whoa. oh my <laughs> Oh my! I just, I just jumped right up. <laughs> Made it after oh, Did you really? Yeah. <laughs> what a bird. Don't oh, have fun on the swinging box. <laughs> the swinging box was dope. I don't want to do the swinging box. I was swinging. Is it that heavy? What's going on here? Oh yeah. Super heavy. Yeah, heavy bitch. Hefty. Either the bizarre jack holes or the people. You didn't hear me do that. Are you serious? Right, like, that's kind of ridiculous. Fuck, we lost <laughs> what, if, what if we transform in here and, like, just rip them apart? Yeah. It's time for fireworks. Nobody's getting out alive. Joe, I don't want to die, you asshole. Hey, who's there? Come on. Oh, you heard that, though. Right. Stop! Are we talking? Or we'll blow the goddamn tower, I swear! Negotiate. I found the bombs. Let's talk. The time for talking is over. We're gonna fuck this place up. You're not listening. You're done. I want it to be over. And to leave the city safely. Help me, 
and I'll help you. You're fooling yourself, Jack. Nobody's letting this out no, of here No, he's alive. Jack. Look, I am a pilgrim. It's fair. Let's just blow it up already. I dare you. I know you won't do it. Don't listen to him, Jack. It's over. Fuck it up! I don't know. I'm scared. Joe, wait. Joe, hey. Isn't that the pilgrim who showed up at the bazaar recently? Maybe. Pilgrim or Pope. So what? Don't you get it? If he's a pilgrim, he can get us out. Lead us out of the city to someplace safe. I don't trust that fucker. You don't trust anyone. I told you to play nice with Barney when we had the chance. Fucking listen to me for once. Well, play nice with Barney? What for? To make him get the fuck out of the bazaar. After what we found out from the peacekeepers. We tipped off the fucker, gave him a chance to run. But he thought he was too clever for that. They warned Barney. About what? Well, about Luke is wanting to take him in on weapons charges, among others. But set a trap for him for weeks. And instead of politely getting the fuck out of here, he tried to play cute instead. So, Barney knew Lucas was after him. The moron wanted to start a war in old Villador. And you ask me, war's the last thing we need. Money, crystals, that's a different story. That's why I tried to put an end to that rabbit dog and his sister. So, Pilgrim, will you get us out of the city or what? Calm down, Joe. I won't fucking calm down. Get us out of the city, Pilgrim. To the nearest safe settlement. And no one will die here. We have the bombs. All right, we'll, we'll help him, all right? I can get you out of town. Huh? But first, I have my own business sure, to take here. care of. This is your we game. need to hide mm. somewhere and wait. Sounds like a huge risk. No risk, no gain. He's lying, Jack. There's no other way. Fuck! I don't like it. I fucking don't. But okay. <laughs> we'll be waiting Does for you anyway. in the tunnels near the Tango Motel. We'll give you a signal when we get there. Good choice. Now give me the detonator, Jack. What a nice guy. Why is he walking so slow? Oh. You're telling me they didn't hear that echo throughout this entire building. That's what I'm saying. Like, it was weird. That made no sense. So they were quietly talking with each other? Right. <laughs> oh, there's a tape. Activate a Alright, uh, so what now, Aiden? Smart guy. Who gets control of the water? Uh, hold up. What? City oh, on India. Yeah. When you assign a facility to peacekeepers or survivors, they start controlling the zone around it. And a faction takes over its zone and introduces its structures. Peacekeepers start installing combat focused traps while survivors build parkour helpers that make traversal easier. Oh, I'd rather do the traversal. Sure. Assigned to survivor. Zip lines. And car traps. Airbags, car traps. Yeah, I'm gonna just give it to the survivors. Under pressure. Do it up. I like how they just know what choice I made that showing up. Hey! Sub fuckers, heard you guys had water. <laughs> Sounds pretty good if I do say so myself. Heard you guys had water and free rent. <laughs> <laughs> oh, they put a house right on top of the tower. Look at that. Hell yeah, dude. Dibs. Plop. <laughs> Horseshoe water tower. Ooh. Now you can activate windmills in the area to unlock faction supplies. Aiden's stash. You've unlocked the city alignment zoom... Zoom level? What? Oh, you just zoom further out. Oh, there's a whole place. We still gotta get to the central loop. Mm hmm City rewards. Awesome. Why does the zip button look like a fucking 
Hack on. You got noose. Hey then, where the See fuck that? are you? Yeah, I don't know. Looks what the, the hell? Was trying to capture him. Jack and Joe warned him. They could have. They could have chosen the trap. Better, but he went into it anyway. Probably. Yeah. Oh, the zipline is kind of cool though. What's a big ass zipline? Let me check out Barney's hideout at the Hotel Tango. I'll make sure the place is safe. UV traps will be nice. Oh, there's a winch. Yeah, UV traps is pretty OP. If you ever see UV traps, make sure you get that one from the peacekeepers. Oh yeah, absolutely. And we're on our way. What's up, party people? My name is Guyber. Welcome back to my channel. Today we are continuing with <laughs> Dying Light 2. <laughs> I like how the music stops for that too. We are searching Barney's quarters because apparently we're calling him out on his bullshit of killing what's his face? Lucas. <laughs> Tell how much I'm paying attention to the story so far. We're just with names though. I'm horrible with names in general. So hopefully we don't kill him. Cause it I thought we killed Herman, but apparently he's so badass that he just didn't feel anything the entire time. Taking sledgehammers to the back of the head. You know, that's normal. It's fine. Oh, shit. Okay, this is where we are. Padded high tops. Oh, no. I'm full on, like, inventory, inventory. Uh, yeah. We'll just get rid of all of our green... Gray. This might take a minute. <laughs> that should be a little bit better. All right. Let's see if he really is bullshitting this entire situation. Investigate. Is this some kind of collector or what? I want a crystal. It's mine. That's the crystal that I should have gotten when I first saved his ass. Yo. Hello? Oh, this place is a pigsty. Well, I mean, he has no reason to clean. It's a zombie apocalypse. That ain't no proof. That ain't no proof. Aiden, some bullshit. Hurry up. Someone's coming your way. Oh, good. Uh, great. Get out of there. Now. Shit, 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 shit. Here's something. Oh, no. Hey, what the hell? Oh, fuck. That's. That's human skin. Yep. Packard, I found the tattoo they cut out of Lucas. Damn freaks. What? Yeah. Mm. Oh, I'm gonna throw up. Get the hell out of there. We still ain't Orland. Why are you going through my sister's stuff? Your sister's stuff? Didn't know they were hiring pilgrims as housekeepers in this hole. Are you shedding skin, Barney? What the fuck is... We didn't... A little piece of Lucas to remember him by, you sicko? No, no, I believe him. Fuck you. His first I intention. Try, but that ain't mine. I'll kill you, you son of a bitch. No, don't. Come on. <laughs> Get out of there. No, I don't want to kill you. I don't want to kill you. <laughs> I just need to put you down real quick. Come on. Go down. Asshole. Oh, that hurts. Okay, that makes sense of why I'm getting my ass kicked. Oh, cutscene. Let's let's get out of here. No, I'm leaving him. I'm not Stop trying to kill it. him. What's going on here, for fuck's sake? Are you nuts? He's he's setting us up. This fucking pilgrim is framing us. What is he talking about, Aiden? I found the proof, hidden among your things. Proof? O of what? You cut the tattoo from Commander Lucas's arm. After his death? Or when he was still alive? 
You're out of your mind. I didn't do it. Maybe you didn't. But your crazy brother... Barney's not a psycho. We have nothing to do with Lucas's death. I'm going to aid her. I've got the proof he's looking for. Aiden, it's not us. Nobody at the bazaar will believe you. Mm. Then where did this piece of skin come from? I just so need info. Come on. It could have been planted to set us up. It was in the Can open. Think of that. Who would do that? And why? To distract everyone from the real killer. Who gained the most from killing Lucas? Who had the most to gain? If it was that easy for you to get in here, then someone else could have come in here before you and planted that. What do you mean that doesn't matter? I want choices in this game. Come on. It doesn't matter. This is between you and Ader now. Wait. Please. I believe her, honestly. Ader doesn't care about the truth. He doesn't care about finding the real killer. He's only looking for a reason to raid the bazaar. It's not my war, Sophie. <sighs> no. Stop making it your war. But you'll have blood on your hands. Blood of innocence. Someone is setting us up. Someone clever. We're not sadists who would skin Lucas, Aiden. And you know it. But I know that you want to get rid of the PKs. Yes. And we will get rid of them. But not like psychos and assassins, Aiden. Believe me, this is a setup. I'll help you get to the center. I promise. How? By getting rid of the biggest problem of this land. The PKs. That seems dangerous. We've been preparing for this for a long time. I'll tell you everything when I'm ready. Stay close to your radio, Aiden. Time to make some changes around here. We're going right back to where we started. At least I didn't kill him. That I am happy about. Where do we go next? Wait for Sophie's call. What do we just kick ass and take names? Accept distress. Seems like we just gotta wait. So she finally contacted us and told us to come to the bazaar. It only took like two minutes, just had to run away from their little hideout there. Buddy? Are we calling him Buddy? Oh yeah, I'm level five by the way. <laughs> I don't know if you guys noticed that I've been leveling up really fast. At least to me it's really fast. Might be really slow. I am going really slow in the storyline of the game. This is madness, so the peacekeepers have more weapons. Men. They will crush us like worms. Ator may have more men, but we have the home field advantage. Home field advantage? You're crazy. I forbid it. While I lead the bazaar, no one will attack the peacekeepers. You no longer lead the bazaar. What? You're no leader, Carl. Never were. We lost people because of you. Crystals. You almost got yourself killed. My mother wanted a free bazaar. Not slaves serving the peacekeepers. I want to restore peace here. You can help me with this. Or leave. Roger, Humphrey. Arrest them. What are you doing? They want to betray the bazaar. Roger! You have no power anymore, Carl. You want to be like your mother. You have blood on your hands, Sophie. A lot of blood. Carl is right. We don't stand a chance in open battle. Sophie! What the- Therefore, we're gonna weaken them first. What do you mean? We'll cut off their main source of electricity. Without UV lamps, Ador can't defend his base. They will be driven from the metro tunnels and cut off from the armory. How does all this get me to the central loop? Once Ador is weakened, he will retreat for reinforcements. Then you can make it to the central loop, Aiden. But first, we have to blow up the windmill. We have to blow up the windmill? And fast. Before Ador gets wind of what we're planning. Barney, gather our people. Be ready. Roger and Humphrey, go to the armory. Provide weapons to anyone capable of fighting. And you, Aiden, go to Alberto and Vincenzo. They'll walk you through the plan. Oh, they'll okay. walk you through the plan. Community and freedom, Aiden. Together, we will win. I don't know, man. This... Mm, I'm so skeptical about the entire thing. 
I missed the steps I did. What can I do? Hey, Alberto! This new armor of yours, split more fit for a beetle than people. Yeah, way too thin. Felix Stein! Peter shows a great protection. This is top craftsmanship made from the finest quality materials. Made, built from. Ah! Ah! Uh oh, I can almost see the steam pouring from his ears. Look out, he's gonna blow. <laughs> Titanium. We reinforce the armor with titanium we pulled from the scrapyard. That's why they're lighter and better protection. You guys shouldn't be such dicks. Smart well, guy. Why didn't he just say so? Oh, shit. We'll see. Thanks, Vincenzo. You didn't have to. It was nothing, Dad. Ah. As for you, those two oafs took the last titanium vests. No, I'm not here for armor. Sophie sent me. You're supposed to bring me in on some plan? The plan? My plan? Carl agreed? Carl agreed! You hear that, Vincenzo? Win me. We take down Not the windmill. Carl. Bingo! The big windmill that provides power to the PK headquarter. But first, we need the charges that Jack and Joe... After we blow it up, all the UV lamps in the PK headquarters will go out. That'll allow the infected to attack them. Hmm? Old Villador will be free again. And you, you... <sighs> Have a clear route to, uh, uh, you know, past the chemical fall. The central loop? Yes. The central loop! Right! I How forgot what it PK was. The PK will withdraw and not retaliate. Because Dad designed this windmill. Without oh, okay. it, the PKs won't last another night, you know. But we must act. <sighs> okay, so. Yes, it. A lot of people. Only if the PK don't tap. They stole that we took, took it. it. Exact without electricity, they So the they plan on having them run away. The we need the charges to destroy the windmill. My fun. Okay. Let me know once you get But if they don't run away, then I gotta fight them on top of all those Zambonis, but windmill. It's fine by me, there'll, there'll be a lot of Zambonis. Yeah, there we go. Way we're heading not that way. We're going this way. We are really fast now. Find something. I didn't hurt him. What is he talking about? I pushed him out of the way. I don't know what all those noises are, but I'm just gonna keep going. I got a bad feeling about this. Get along with that. Oh, come on. What's going on here? What happened here? What the hell is going on? What's going on here? PKs. They've been searching us for weapons. Oh, come on. And where are the bombs for Alberto? We managed to send some out. The couriers last reported near Star Square. Then silence. Alberto? Oh. The charges are gone. I'm going to the Star Square. That was their last check-in. Oh. Oh, my. Exactly. Aiden? Yeah. Be careful. Someone sold us out. Find the, the charges. 